and welcome back to Outside My House. I've got the kettlebell again, so I've taken it outdoors. And today we're gonna to do another leg exercise which works a little more the inside of your thigh, your inner thigh, your glutes, and somewhat your quads as well. And it's called a plie squat. If you're at the gym, you might wanna do these with a bar or with the Smith machine. But if you're at home, you can use your kettlebell, you can use free weights, or perhaps starting off just nothing at all and really working on the form. I'm going to hold the weight loosely in front of me, and my feet are a little greater than shoulder width apart. You watch as you lower. You mainly want to keep your knee from going beyond your toes. So a little greater than shoulder width apart. I'm going to inhale as I lower, and my knees aren't going beyond my toes. I can feel it through here and through here. Exhale as I rise back upwards, not locking out. If I were to stop at the top and lock out my legs, it gives my muscles too much of a break in between the repetitions. So you inhale as you lower, pause briefly, and exhale as you controlled, bring it up, and inhale and bring it back down. And if you pause for a second at the bottom, you can feel these working, but that's the only point where you might want to pause. If you pause at the top, you make it easier on yourself and give your muscles a break. Inhale as you lower, exhale as you come up. And this is more of a high repetition exercise in the sense that you're not going to be doing it with heavy, heavy weights at your house. So if you're using a kettlebell or no weights at all, you might want to do 20 repetitions or so. Then take your 30 minutes, 30 seconds to a minute break, stretch your quads. And then get back into it and do another 20 reps. Plie squat, front of your legs, inner thigh, glutes, controlled as you lowered. Bring it back up and don't rest at the top, bring it right back down. 